it's Wendy. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to talk about my jewelry collection. And this is pretty much everything that I wear in rotation all the time. I might have a couple of other pieces. I consider those more of my splash pieces. They don't really go with everything in my wardrobe, but I can wear them on occasion. So let's get right into it. So what I want to talk about first is my watches and I do have this beautiful box. Now, this is my Nordgreen watch. These are made in Denmark, I believe. You can see it's just a beautiful navy blue box that my watch came in. They're a little bit more on the pricier side. I think this was a couple hundred dollars for this set. And I did have a discount that I got from somebody else. I just want to show you the inside of the box here real quick. So everything is made with recycled materials. It comes beautifully packaged. And these watches are very well made. I mean, they're absolutely stunning. So the set that I ordered is the, the navy blue um, dial, bezel, whatever you want to call it, with the silver details. So here is my navy blue watch isn't that gorgeous and this is the silver metal band that it came with and these are interchangeable and they're actually really easy to change out on these watches and then this one came with not just the silver band it came with a brown leather strap a navy blue leather strap and then they gave you a free strap so you could pick whatever you wanted and the straps are like $40 a piece. So I opted for black. And it's just got these little pins. You just press it, take it out of the actual watch face, and then you put the new one in, press it, and then they'll pop into place, okay? So that watch I'm gonna have for many, many years. And then this little guy I picked up on Poshmark. This is just, I think it's an Armatron, but it's a cute watch. And I do wear this more in the summertime. It's got a real pale pink dial on it there, silver. Okay, so this is like $25. And then this other one, now I got this on Amazon. I think this is still available. I'll put the link in the description box below and that is um, an affiliate link for me. So if you do buy that, I make a very small amount, but nonetheless. You can see this is gorgeous, isn't it? Anne Klein has beautifully made watches. And this one is the black leather with the gold. Lots of different styles and designs that you can get. And I think I got this on sale for under $30. It was like half off or something like that. So those are my watches. And then next is going to be my silver jewelry. So I'm actually wearing just some simple little silver hoops here. And these, I believe, are sterling silver over stainless or something like that. I got these at TJ Maxx. You can always find really good jewelry for great prices at TJ Maxx. And then I got these super cute twisted silver. I'm not exactly sure of the name. I, I just call it twisted because they're twisted. Can you see that? They got that lovely little texture. They're super lightweight. And I think these are titanium because I have super sensitive ears, so I have to be careful what I wear. And I got these off of Amazon, so if there's a still available, I will link them in the description box below. And they do not hurt my ears at all. And then I just have this super cute, chunky, sterling silver bracelet. I've had this for many, many years, and I couldn't even tell you now where I bought this. It might have been at TJ Maxx years ago. Okay. And then next up, I have some vintage pins, and I wanted to throw those in here in case any of you out there like to wear pins like I do. And of course, you can just put one anywhere you want. You could put one on, if you're wearing a blazer on a lapel, you can put one on a sweater, or you can take a bunch of them and kind of put them on your sweater for art. And they look really cool. And these I've just picked up at different places, you know, whether it's a thrift store or on Poshmark if I was looking for something in particular. And the first two are just some gold colored brooches, just a single leaf here. Super cute, this was just a couple of dollars. And then this one I got on Poshmark, this was a little bit more expensive. 
but this is an art deco and i absolutely love art deco and you can see it's gold and silver isn't that cool and then i think that might be lucite in there but looks great with my black blazers looks even really good with my with my beige blazers okay so i've got those two and then I have a couple of the clear rhinestone brooches. This one almost looks like, you can see that, a little snowflake. Isn't that pretty? So super tiny. A little less in diameter than a quarter. But so pretty on my blazers. And then this one is really old. It almost looks like a flirty lee. I mean, that's not what it is, but it's rhinestone. And I got this at a vintage shop. I've had this one for years, but I do wear them all the time. And then my other one is just this super cute green one. So I just thought this was fun. And this looks really good on my navy blue blazer. Isn't that beautiful? Okay. So that's my little brooches. And then I have this really cute, chunky, gold looped necklace. So pretty. And I got this at an antique shop. So it's obviously not real gold or anything like that, but it doesn't look cheap. And it's pretty heavy and it looks really good when I'm wearing like sweaters or any of my Oxfords and I want something chunkier versus my more delicate gold chain I'm gonna show you. Okay, so we've got that. And then I have this, I think this is the paper clip. Is that what they call this? I believe it's a paper clip. And I should be able to link this. This is from Amazon. Isn't that pretty though? Just a nice little delicate gold. And I wear this quite a bit. Now you can wear this by itself or you can layer it. Now I actually wear this by itself and then I will layer it with my gold cross. You can see my gold cross necklace there. Isn't that pretty? So that's Amazon as well. And I believe this and the paperclip one, I think these are actually, um, Mia Bella and I have a little bracelet from them so I'm just going to show you the box real quick just so if you're not familiar with this brand see how cute that is they come in these nights they come very well packaged and Mia Bella is from Italy and a lot of it is you know either the silver or the gold plated but it's very well made so I got this little chunky kind of like a paperclip style just a little gold bracelet there. Isn't that beautiful? And I think it was like around $20 or something like that. Very well made though. Very sturdy. And then this little box here. There's another little. See that? Just beautiful boxes they put them in. With the, with the made in Italy on it. And then I have this little vintage gold bangle. I just thought this was so cute. It was like $1 at the thrift store. But it doesn't look cheap. That's what I loved about it. And it just looks really good. Just pop it on. So if you want to wear something a little bit chunkier. And you're wearing gold for the day. Okay. And then I have a couple of... Um, well, one more pair of earrings. Now these are my gold hoops. And I think I mentioned in another video that they were from Amazon. But I believe I got these from TJ Maxx. Aren't they cute? They're like $16 and they're the gold over the silver or whatever. I don't know, but they don't bother my ears. And again, I have super sensitive ears. And then I have a little vintage gold. It's like a little flower with a little diamond in it. It's just a little vintage ring I got in an antique shop. I just thought it was cute. And then I got a couple more rings. Now, these are both from Mia Bella. I don't think this little signet ring is available right now. Isn't that gorgeous? If I can find one, I'll link it down below in the description box. And then I just picked up this little guy. Now, you can get this in silver. This is actually um, gold and silver. And it's got the star and the moon going all the way around it. Isn't that pretty? Just a gorgeous little ring. Now it's a little bit on the smaller size. So if you're sizing like you think you need a seven, you're going to put it on your ring finger. You might want to get a size eight, depending on where you want to put it. I would size up, but it depends. Um, this one actually fit true to size. This is the size. I think this is a size seven. No, that might be a size six. Yep. Okay. So again, Amazon. 
And then what I'm wearing right now, these are just, this I got years ago. It's one of those spinner um, titanium rings. It's a silver one. And then this cute little silver ring here. I forget what the name of that stone is now. It's um, it's genuine, but I've had it for years. And then this I got, um, this is um, Mor Morgan. I, I'm not really sure. I'm sorry. But I've had this for a very long time. I got this at a jewelry shop when I was traveling and then a little silver Celtic ring. So that's just some of the jewelry that um, I wear on heavy rotation. And I really like to change it up. So sometimes I'll wear my silver and my gold together. And of course, you can definitely do that because the Art Deco has silver and gold. So I just do what I like. And these videos are just to kind of give you an idea of how I built out different components of my wardrobe from clothes to shoes to outerwear to accessories and just to kind of give you an idea that you don't always have to go and buy retail and I like to save money I like to to budget shop and I do like to thrift shop and I think that's also good for the environment instead of everything else seems to be you know this throwaway buy it and you have it for a little while and then you get rid of it so I always end up getting all that good stuff from the thrift stores and I live in a pretty remote area it's a lot of country, small little towns, and I'm still able to find some pretty cool deals and find some really exceptional pieces. And it doesn't matter what it is in my wardrobe. So I hope you found this video helpful. Stay tuned for my upcoming styling videos. And I might throw um, belt and scarves in a, in a little video too, just to kind of show you what I have for those little last um, accessories for my wardrobe. So please give me a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and also don't forget to hit the bell notification so you get notified when I upload new videos. And I upload new videos once a week. Usually that's every single Wednesday, early evening. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Take care. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Bye.